Hi, I'm Patrice Putman, Director of Employee Development here at Maine General Health. Maine General Health has 3,500 employees. We're the third largest healthcare provider in Maine. We did a system-wide survey back in 2003, and it found that 20% of our employees felt that we did not deal with conflict well within the organization. And we knew how important that was for a healthcare organization to deal with conflict well, both for employee satisfaction and for patient satisfaction. So the executive group decided to approach this very uh, aggressively and charged my department with trying to find a, a solution to this con their concerns around conflict. I started researching. I started researching a, a variety of different um, approaches to the issue of conflict. And I read about crucial conversations in a, in a nursing magazine. I bought, bought the book, read it, liked it. I um, happened to attend a conference where one of the authors was speaking, liked what he had to say. Uh, we had somebody from Vital Smarts come to Maine General and present the, the approach to all of our managers, about 200 managers, and they loved it. From there, it was easy. The senior management all volunteered to be trained themselves as a starting point. A dozen of us were trained as trainers, and we've been training ever since. We train at least monthly. We have waiting lists for our training. It's all volunteer. We train about 20 people a month. We've trained uh, about 1,000 people in, uh, in the last few years, and people love it. People love it. The results are the most exciting thing about what we've done. Not only have we continued to improve employee satisfaction, we've improved dramatically our ability to deal with conflict and our ability to communicate throughout the organization. So that was our original goal. In addition to that, we've had oh, some wonderful results around patient safety. When we first started, only 10% of, of our staff um, would speak up when they saw mistake, disrespect, lack of initiative, poor teamwork. And with the work that we've done, the people who have been trained have moved from 10% willingness to speak up to 50% willingness to speak up, which is a huge difference. And not only that, but over the last year, we've seen a cultural shift happen. And even if they have not been trained, now we have 37% of our staff speaking up when they've seen a mistake. And that translates into dramatic patient safety results. And that's the thing that I'm most excited about. We've dealt with the conflict and our patients are safer now. The quality of care is better and, um, and that's why we're in business here.